Day 19, just woke up at my dad's. I'm not sure I'm gonna be able to vlog today. I've got so much going on. I need to get the car from here, drive all the way to Northwest London, get all my stuff, come back. I'm not probably not gonna work out or do anything, but I'll try and vlog. If not, I will do some sort of informational video or talk. There'll be value. There's always value. Wow, what a day, long, long day. No time to vlog, guys. Not sure the lighting's actually good here, but it doesn't matter, I'm gonna go for it anyway. Yeah, no time to vlog today. All I was doing was just moving my stuff, um, driving, packing, driving back down here, packing. Finally, it's all done. It's like 11 p.m. at night, long, long day. Definitely got my steps in though, which was good. I'm gonna answer a question though, because I still wanna give some value. Someone asked me the other day, would I keep my uh, calories and macros the same on a rest day compared to a training day? And the answer would be no, if you can help it. You wanna try and keep calories lower on rest days because you're gonna have less activity, less energy expenditure. Um, and there's way, ways I do this for clients through equations, but basically the bottom line is you're gonna require less carbs on rest days. On workout days, you need more carbs as those, those carbs are gonna be used as glycogen either to fuel your workouts or to replace the glycogen, which is the energy in your muscles that's been used up in the workout. On rest days, you can lower your calories, bring your carbs down, maybe even increase fat a little bit. But we, we can get to equations and you know times in body weight by a certain number, but the bottom line is more carbs on workout days, less carbs on rest days. Today wasn't really a workout day, although it did feel like a workout, lugging all that stuff around, but I kept my carbs lower, uh, fat's a little bit higher than they normally are, and then tomorrow I'm back to training my carbs are gonna be higher, bring my fats down to where they should be. So that's a little tip guys, higher carbs on training days because you need it, lower carbs on rest days. Okay, I'm going to bed and back to normal vlogging tomorrow. <laughs>